Hi, I'm Tony Fleming, and this is Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey everybody, thanks for joining us on today's video, 2007 Maserati Quattroporte Executive GT Edition. I mean, that is a mouthful, and the reason it's a mouthful is because these cars are spectacular. If you've never had a chance to get a great luxury car that's reliable, powerful, and ridiculously uh, handsome, uh, check for a minute on this here, and let's walk around and look at some of the things that you're gonna get with it. On top of not only what you do see, we'll talk about some stuff that you can't see as well. So come on up here first, and let's just look at this right for a second, okay? This is called Grigio Silver, so it's on between dark gray and silver metallic paint, and it is gorgeous. And the reason why it's so gorgeous is because it's in the same family as the interior. When we walk inside, you're gonna see that. The one thing I wanted to show you is, it's important to know when you're getting a car, like what am I really getting? How do I know somebody took care of it? What is it gonna be to me when I finally take it over? So for instance, like this car here, this one has the clear bra on it, right? So it's installed, uh, he probably had it installed at the factory when he bought it new, all right? And this is a clear plastic film that as this uh, takes all the brunt of the chips and things like that, once this gets peppered and it becomes ugly, you peel this off and the paint underneath is spectacular. And then what you can do is you wanna put a new one back on, uh, you're good to go for another three or four years. So that's up to you. I love the front end of these things. This right here with the polished grill. Headlight washers are built in, but they're hidden. See how they're buried in here? It's got halogen projector headlights on it. Just the styling keeps going. All right, so come on over here. Okay, we got a fresh set of tires here. And we're talking about Pirellis. And the reason I bring that up is because, you know, if you're just, uh, uh, if you just own a car and you're looking to flip it, like let's say it's a lease turn in or something like that, and you had to put tires on it, you put the cheapest tire that you could get. But if this is your baby, you love this car, and, uh, and your plans are to keep it, uh, or whether you don't or you do, but whatever, you're going to put the best tire you can. You're not going to overpay, overpay for tires, but you're going to uh, buy the best tires you can for your baby. In this case here, uh, the Pirelli P0s, not inexpensive, but a really nice tire, and they look great on this rim as well, okay? These fender vents, another great styling feature. Check out the turn signal right in there, and of course, the designer of the, the, the style of the car, Pin Inferina, which is uh, just awesome. So uh, a lot of what you see on the outside looks great, but you never really get a chance to check underneath the hood and get some conversation about that, and that's kind of what I want to talk about right now. So let's do that for a second. All right, check this out. This is really nice. Now this is kind of cool because there's some things you're gonna see and some you might not have noticed, but for instance, like the hood insulation here is pretty thick. So it keeps the sound down here, but lets all the noise come out the tailpipes and this car just sounds spectacular. But look what it does here. They build this piece to seal around the resonance that you might get from the intake manifold opening and all the disturbance that might go on inside there. They did a great job here filling in these panels. So part of the styling feature of this car is a long front end. It doesn't need this front end uh, for seating or anything like that. And what they've done is they've taken the engine and slid it back here, making it more mid-engine than front engine. And what you want to see is that it's behind the front axle. When the engine is behind the front axle, the balance of the whole car is significantly better, meaning that as you go around a corner, it doesn't have the entire weight of the engine over the front wheels, it's behind the rear wheels. Big difference. But this here, they make so beautiful, and that's what I wanted to show you is this. Check this out. They paint the valve covers with a special coating uh, in bright red, intake manifold uh, in black. All right, and then all the original decals and stickers are still around the car. And the reason you want to see that is that way you know whether the car's been in an accident or not. You can't buy this tag. If this car here had been in an accident and this piece here had to be replaced, you could not reassemble, or sorry, you couldn't buy that tag right there. Original decals there, decals there, okay? Everything just so nicely done in this car. It's just nice and complete. This is a place you may never see again. If you buy this car, you may never open the hood again. But if you do open the hood, uh, it looks spectacular. You could take this car to a car show. I like to talk about the styling of the car. I personally think there is really no better looking uh, four-door sedan in the world than these cars here. They are truly spectacular with the quad pipes coming out the back, the tail like this, this beautiful package tray filled in. All of this is leather too, by the way. When we get inside, you're gonna say, wow, I'm talking every square inch down to the floor mats is leather, all right? All right, so let's check this out. You're saying I'm getting a nice sedan, what's going on? All right, look at this trunk. Look at the size of that. Isn't that very nice? You get all of that in there. You get this right here, more storage inside here. This is a tire inflator kit, okay, and a tool kit. You can also get a spare tire if you want to, but a lot of people don't want to use the up the room in there, so they leave that empty. Okay, even every little bit in here is done nicely. Little clips to hold parts together. 
It's just nice. You put your owner's manual right back there in the corner. Okay. Electric pull down, parking sensors. So when you back up, it beep, 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 beep right? And then uh, once it uh, gives a steady beep, then you're one foot away from your object, okay? All right, so we walked around the outside of the car. We've looked at the front, we've looked in the back. And you know what? That's what everybody else is gonna see. Let's go ahead and see what you're gonna see all the time. Let's move into the front. Okay, so I'm asking you this real quick question. In your lifetime, have you seen a better looking interior? Absolutely not. The Italians are known for great suits, great leather. And here, this car uh, proves all of that to be exactly the same. The stitching, the contrasting uh, welting in there. Look at the stitching is the same color as uh, the piping in the seats. Stitching in the console. And then this wood, this wood is just ridiculously rich and good looking. Uh, and we haven't even got into the features part of the car. The door panels, look at how great they are stitched down the sides. The stripes on there giving that sporty look, all right? So all of that, including the dash right here, is all colored, covered in leather. This right here is suede Alcantara, okay? Then these handles are spring-loaded. Watch this. They go up, so if somebody wanted to get in, maybe you have a, you know, an elderly person getting in that needs some help, or maybe you just had your knee done, whatever, boom. Keeps it out of the way. It's just really, really nice. Even the headrests are reliefs, not embossed, reliefs. So they're done from behind, and you can feel them, okay? We'll get in the back in just a second. I just want to show you the rest of it. So in here is storage. These are also heated and cooled cup holders, okay? Charging port, cup holder again here. Then all the controls that you need for uh, uh, accessing the, the system here. So it has uh, uh, navigation. It has uh, all the features that you could expect in a hi-fi uh, audio system, all right? Climate control, separate for both sides, okay? heated seats, um, ventilated seats, power mirrors, kind of cool stuff where the mirrors actually uh, fold in if you need them to, like if you came to a bank and you wanted to, to fold the mirrors in, you could do that. Uh, this has a tilt and telescopic. All the controls are here. And like, look at these cool chrome rings around everything. It's just a styling thing that these uh, the Italians do. Full uh, wood wheel. And then I, I, I'm getting stuck and because I'm so excited, I start to say too many things at once and uh, mess it all up. But anyway, the Bose sound system in here is awesome. And it's a digital sound system with the center channel as well. So it sounds great. All right, 200 mile an hour speedometer, 9,000 RPM tech, 9,000 RPM tech, okay? These cars are fast. They sound ridiculous and they are exotic and beautiful, yet they're incredibly reliable. Keep in mind, this car came with a four year 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty when it was new. Had they had built a really uh, POS, uh, they would have been bankrupt uh, in just the first year. But these cars have been great. We sell a ton of them and people trade them in all the time and get something, uh, get a new one. Even things like this right here, these are custom made leather mats for the car, okay? You don't have to put them on if you don't want to, but they are uh, waterproof, stain proof, and you just wipe them off. They have a special patented system. They're from Italy. I met the designer and the owner of the company on these mats, and they are the hottest new thing. We've been putting them in all the cars because they look spectacular. Look how beautiful that mat is. It fits in there gorgeous. I mean, it just takes the whole car to a whole nother level. Okay, uh, one of the things I want to show you about, which is one of the reasons people love these cars so much, is that they're sporty, yet they can be uh, fully functional as a daily driver. So if you wanted to drive this car really fast or really wanted to enjoy uh, a manual transmission car, it has paddle shifters here. This car actually has a clutch in it and the transmission's in the back of the car and you would shift it up and down like this right here and it'll even have, it says shift up or shift down right on the dash, okay? And then if, uh, if you want to, let's say you're, you're busy or you need to jump on the cell phone or what have you, you just go ahead and you push this button right here and it turns it into automatic transmission. You don't have to worry about anything. Get on the cell phone, do your thing or, or whatever it is you need to handle. But it's the best of both worlds. It sounds great. And also when you push the sport button and you go to downshift the car, it actually blips the throttle automatically. You sound like this incredible race car driver and that 400 horsepower V8 sounds sick. Check out these back seats here, okay? This is beautiful because the back seat itself is power. And what they did was they cut out these back of these seats, okay, to give people like myself, I'm 6'1". This seat is far forward back, I'm 6'1". And look how much room I have uh, to drive this car. Back in here, the sunshade, let's say the sun's just a little too much on you, okay? That takes that right out of the way. Then you have your own climate control system. You have uh, 
curtain airbags here, here, front. Just, uh, I mean, just a spectacular piece of engineering style and grace. I mean, amazing with uh, this great clock in the middle, which is circa like 1920s or 30s, original Maserati style, and it still fits so well in this modern uh, Maserati Quattroporte. <laughs> You know, in closing up this video, we're talking a car that's stickered for somewhere around $126,000 originally. Low mileage, uh, spectacular style, and price now that makes it affordable to the regular person. So there, I don't feel like you can get style or, or this kind of luxury, any car in the world, for this kind of dollar. That's my, that's my thought, just saying, all right? Anyway, if there's any way you can find a way to get this incredible car in your life, Maserati Quattroporte, Executive GT Edition with that ridiculous interior that we were just in. Call us, 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about it.